OMG, there's a girl next to me wearing jeans. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so lol. <laughs> okay, ciao, babes. John? John? Are you in there? Do you feel I'm a trustworthy man? Because if you do, I have a foolproof plan to not only make sure your cash is quite safe, but attracting a very nice interest rate. Oh, babes, I'm as sure as sure can be, as if I'd read it in the leaves of the tea. See you tomorrow, here at one. You betcha. See you, hun. You've got to do this. I'm not hurting the baby. Our baby needs a mum as well as a dad. I am not letting anything happen to you, especially when it's my fault. But it's not. Why are you saying that? Do it for us. Please. All right. All right. Good, good. You used to be a ring girl, didn't you, Gemma? Yeah. Still people look at me and all they see is the TNA. I'm not stupid. Oh, I wouldn't be working with you if you were. I got a B for my English GCSE. Catcher in the Rye did. And Romeo and Juliet. Give me my Romeo. And when I shall die, take him and cut him out in little stars. <sighs> School. Seems a long way away now. More champagne, yeah? Thanks for the advice. Excuse me? I told Joe everything and he just walked away. Didn't say a word. I reckon he's dumped me, only he didn't even say that. I don't know what this is about, but can I help? What use would you be? I didn't want any help from any of you, thanks. She's done enough. If your boyfriend's an immature idiot, then that's hardly my... I just thought if I just told him, everything would be fine. And now everything's ruined. We caught the plane with the CS and Teaks to Barcelona. The weather was frightful, but the hombres... Oh, Le Jose. I was shooting with the Brocklebanks and some of those beaters. Oh, they can beat me any time. <laughs> I wish someone would. Mimi, how was your weekend? Uh, yeah, great, yeah. What was it? Strictly come ice dancing and a packet of bourbons? <laughs> no. They were Jaffa cakes, actually. You don't love me. I do. Got any more? Jimmy, you're doing way too much of that stuff. Why don't you try eating or sleeping for a change? You have no mm -hmm. idea what it's like. I'm getting screwed by my old man. When it comes to that, darling, you're an absolute beginner. That's it. Am I dismissed? Lottie, oh. thank you for coming on the show. Uh, tell us about your new single. Well, it's sort of like a meditation on love, ambition and desire. It's called You Know You Love It and it's out now. OK, so uh, what made you get into music? Oh, my agent did. But what made you switch from presenter to music? Well, you see, Emma, for some people, sitting on a sofa interviewing celebrities is like the peak of their ambition. But for me, I was just, like, cursed with this talent that I just had to release into the world. You know you love it. Uh -huh. You know you love it. Didn't want to meet at your house. No problem. Yeah. I just don't think it's ever going to work out, me and you. What? Because I'm a dad. Forget him, he's got nothing to do with it. It's not him, Flick. Mommy, what's happened? Nothing. Nothing's happened. So what are you saying? That's it? We finished? Yeah. I don't believe you. Something's happened. Tell me. Vic, I said no, all right? I don't want to go out with you. 